Hey everybody, John Foss, and I'm talking with Nancy Odell about Sex Scandals Crime, which airs July 24th at 8 p.m. on Reels. Nancy, thanks for being here, and tell us what this show is all about. Well, it takes an in-depth look at all the scandals that rock the biggest names in the industry and how um, it all transpired. We, it's, it was a confusing moment, I have to say, in the history. Um, it was a moment in Hollywood I've covered for 20 six years where I'm going like every day I'd come into work and I'd be like, what, who today? Like, what's going on tomorrow? You know, and it would be just crazy. The amount of people who were taken down and the, you know, think about it, like two of the biggest names in morning television didn't have a job anymore. And it was just one of those shocking times in history that now is transpired into a movement that is going to affect all of us and the way that we are in our work and now that we feel comfortable if something happens to us and we feel like we have been wrong you feel comfortable going to the hr department and saying hey I, you know this happened and you know that it's going to be investigated you know that it's going to be taken seriously so it's really just changed our culture but we start with uh, the accusations against harvey weinstein and we have uh, one of his accusers who describes in detail what she says happened to her. Uh, we examine why, uh, you know, because there had been rumblings of um, things that Harvey Weinstein was alleged to have done in the past. So we examine why uh, you didn't hear a lot about some of those things in the past and why it all seemed to happen. It was one period of time. Um, and we examine that and we kind of put it in a timeline for you. And up until today, how it all transpired so that, you know, you can be able to explain to your kids or you understand why now your workplace is different and why the world will be different from now on because of this moment in history where it was such a huge story in Hollywood and a huge story across the world, really.